Hey, what's up, you guys? I don't mind my hair. I woke up a few hours ago. I normally twist my hair when I go to bed. Today, we're gonna do a haul. Uh, I went shopping and I bought some stuff from H&M, Zara, Bershka, good stuff. So I'm gonna like show you guys what I got. I'm gonna show you all of the items and whatnot. I'm pretty excited. I've never done a haul before. So first off, we're gonna start off with sweats. I bought some sweats for winter because I have like hoodies and stuff like that, but I don't have like sweats. You know, the ones that don't really have this, uh, don't have the zippers. I do have long sleeves, those really thin material ones, but I want like really, you know, sweats, sweats, you know, sweats. I guess that's what they call them. Um, the first one I got at H&M is uh, this gray, which honestly gray is like my favorite color, gray, blue, and um, black. Oh, black is another color. It's more of a shade. It's more of a shade, but anyways, I love this color. I love the feel of it. It's so soft. Like it feels so soft. It feels so cozy. I feel like if you fall, if you put this on, you could literally fall asleep. I love H and M stuff. Although they had a little racist thing going on a while a while, a while back. It has this. I don't know what, what, what this is. So I'm not really used to wearing clothes that has this type of um, insulation in it uh, from the Caribbean so it's always hot we don't have the winter what is this thing focus focus okay sorry about that the camera goes off and on the focus I'm sorry I don't know what it's called is it's, it's cotton I don't know but it's it's really soft it doesn't feel itchy um, like some other uh, places like I remember I went to Primark I don't shop there anymore. I don't really like. I don't like the clothes, the quality of the clothes. I do like the jackets. The jackets are super nice. There, they're not the best of qualities, but I mean, for something cheap, you get what you pay for, basically, from Primark. Um, but this, but I bought something similar to this from Primark, um, and I had to give it to my sister because I didn't really like like it, and it was so itchy. But this is this feels so soft. And I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on me. This is the medium. I feel like this fits a little bit too big. Um, but it's still it's still really good. I like it. It goes really well with my grey short 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 pants. Um, it's a really good colour. It's a lot lighter than grey though. But I mean it's it's nice, I like it. Uh, it's good. It makes it look like I'm tough, like I have big muscles when we all know I don't. Oh my god, <laughs> the Mexican Mafia. Anyways, this is it. I like it. It's super cool, super nice, super fun. So yeah, that's what that uh, jacket look, sweat looked like. I actually like it. It fit really, really good. And I didn't even say the size. I think it's in the size... Oh, it's a size small. I'm actually M, but it's a small. I didn't realize that. Um, the next one is uh, I got it in green. It's this green one. And the weird thing is, they had this discount thing on it for four euros, but I actually paid ten. I don't know why the tag was still on it. To be honest, I don't know. Um, but I paid ten euro for this. Uh, as it has the same um, cotton thing. I don't really like green, but I just thought I should just try it on for uh, winter. You know, maybe it might look good with the clothes that I have on. It's really nice. Like, if, like the other shirt, it's soft, it's cozy. It smells horrendous. Uh, oh, I got an extra small. Ooh. Hopefully this fits. Um, I didn't have the receipt, so I might have got to replace it. Yes, I'm going to show you guys what this looks like. I'll definitely say this feel, the quality feels so much better when it's on your skin than when you actually touch it. It feels so much good. It feels nice. It fits nice. Uh, it's not too baggy. It's not too saggy. Because um, some of these sweats, they could be, it can be a bit saggy and make you look like you have a bigger belly than you actually have or chestier chest or like a flabbier chest than you actually have but this 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 it's good it's 
good for 10 euros. It's good. It's good. It's good. To me, this costs 20 euros. Tops. Because, because the quality is really good. You know, it, it's good. It's good. Simple. So it looks like I really like it. Um, it actually fit really, really, really well. Uh, I like the sweats. They're really nice and soft. They're good quality. Um, the next bag, which is another H&M bag, we got a shirt. I love shirts. I think they're super nice. Um, this is a uh, I think this is a size M. This reminds me of home because it has like banana prints banana leaf prints on it and i like the colors the black and blue favorite colors black and blue although black is a shade um it's really nice i like it uh this could go so well with a nice uh t-shirt black or white t-shirt i think underneath it uh, don't quote me i don't know fashion it's nice uh it definitely reminds me back home and i like it it's Every color. Let me show you the way it looks like on me. Oh, and it's really soft. The material is really soft. It's not like nylony. It's not like curtain quality. You know, like it's not. It's soft. There's some of these materials they're quite. They feel like you're having a curtain or like a a tablecloth. But this feels. It feels good. It feels. It feels like they put time into making this. Although now that I'm looking at it, there was a bit of thread on the sides here. I don't know if you can see it. So not that bad, not that good craftsmanship, but I mean the quality is good, so it's normal. And um, I I like this shirt. Um, I feel like it look really better if you open it up, but I don't have another shirt underneath this, so I cannot do that. Cause we don't want to get demonetized. So yeah, that's what it looks like on me. I really like it. Uh, it's a really nice shirt. Sorry I'm wearing this to try on all the clothes, but I just don't want the time to go and change another shirt. Anyways, so the next sh the next item is a t-shirt. Because people can people confuse this and the other thing I just showed. They call this a t-shirt. This is a, this is this is, they call the other thing a shirt and a t-shirt, but this is actually a t-shirt. What I just showed you is a dressy shirt, or you could call it a shirt. Uh, I think there's an, I think the British have a name for it. I think I'm not sure. Uh, this is a, I don't know what color this is. To me, to me, this is a purple, like a light blue, purple, something. Some people might say it's some other color. I'm a guy, and we only see plain colors. Blue. To me, this is purple. Purplish blue, bluish purple, that's it. Maybe in the camera it might look blue, but it, it's kind of purple. Like a purplish blue, like a baby blue purple. Or purple blue baby. I don't know. People have, there's some weird ass names for colors. It's a nice shirt. I think I got this too small. I think this is in, uh, oh, it's in the medium. Oh, okay. It's in the medium. Uh, I'm gonna try it on and show you guys what it looks like. I actually folded it. This is why you see the lines because I folded it myself. Um, it's my OCD when I ever buy something. I like to fold it in the way that I know how to fold. Uh, so this is why they look like they're and they they've been sitting in the bags for a while. I haven't worn worn them at all. I'm gonna show you guys how that looks. That's how the shirt looks. I really like it. I like the color. Um, I'm not sure what it will go with, what kind of pants or clothes it will go with, but I got it anyways. The next shirt I'm going to show is also from H&M. It's uh, this. What color is this? I don't know. Grayish black, blackish gray, something. It's soft, like the other one, soft. It's not as good of quality as the other shirt. This one feels very thin. The material is very thin compared to the other one. It's kind of see-through too. It's very thin. I feel like if this, if you stretch this a bit too much, it could possibly rip. Whilst the other one, the material was a bit thicker. 
um, but it's still a really nice shirt. Uh, yeah, the uh, yeah the material is is quite thin. I'm not sure if I'm saying this right. Anyways, I'm gonna try this on and show you guys what it, what it looks like. Yeah, that's what the shirt looks like. Pretty do really like it. I don't mind my gray shirt. I'm gray pants. I'm not sure if you can see it in the camera while I'm trying on the clothes. Uh, but yeah, I like the shirt. It's, it's it's nice. And that's it for H and M. We're gonna go on to Zara. No, let's try Bushka. Okay, from Bushka, I bought this shirt. A long sleeve one and it's in my favorite shades of color black and white uh, it's in a size M from Bershka for some Bershka and Zara no Bershka and H&M kind of have the same quality in clothes uh, this definitely feels the, like the same it feels this the quality feels the same as the H&M you know uh, it ain't no Zara but it feels that the same, you know. I mean, H and M and Bershka is like normal. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, the quality feels the same. Um, it's nice. I like the color. I'm gonna show you guys how it looks on me. It's really nice. I'm not sure where I will wear this. I need to go to a party or a club or something. I could wear this with a white T-shirt, a black jeans maybe, and a white shoe. Only that people would look too churchy or too frugally, I'm not sure. Be a white shirt and maybe blue jeans and a black um, Jordan or something. I don't know. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. So yeah, that's what it looks like. I really like the uh, the shirt. Um, that's all I bought from. That's all I bought from Bershka. Next one is Zora. Zora, I only bought one thing. And this, it's, uh, it's a jacket. Really, really nice jacket. Uh, what is this called? It's called plaid. Is this what they call plaid? I don't know. Um, I like this shirt, this jacket, sorry. But now that I think about it, what am I gonna wear this with? What does this go with? I don't even know what this goes with. I just saw it and I really liked it. Now I'm looking at it, I'm like, what does this go with? I don't know why there is this thing here there's just this random extra piece of material that's literally taped not really taped but fred sewed into the seam kind of of this part here you can see this like that honestly make no no sense like it serves no purpose just an extra long piece of material i don't know why it's there that's kind of stupid um there are pockets on the inside. I like when there are pockets on the inside of jackets because whenever you're in Paris, the people who pickpocket you, so having the your phone, your wallet in the inside of of the jacket is actually a really good thing to it's, it's, it keeps it safe because they can't really push their hands inside of your jacket, only on the outer side. Um, there is also another ja another pocket on the other side as well. It's quite it's quite nice, but I don't really know what I'm gonna wear this with. I don't know. I just saw it and I liked it, and I'm just thinking, what is this gonna go with? It? But this is definitely a fall jacket, not winter jacket. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on me, and um, yeah.
So that was the jacket from Zara. Um, I I have one more jacket that I bought from Pool and Bear. Um, let me go get it. Okay, so I'm back. To you, to you look like like one like blinking an eye, but to me it was like three minutes. Uh, this is the jacket I bought from Pool and Bear. I really like this jacket. Like it's so soft. It's really soft. Um, it has those uh, wool or cotton or whatever this thing is at the top. I thought it would have it all in the inside. It doesn't have it all in the inside. Um, the buttons are like those things that just pop out. Which I actually like. I, you see like on this side here. Because in the picture you can see the top and the side there. So I thought the inside would have the same thing. Because that's the kind of jacket I wanted. But apparently this didn't have it. And the funny thing is I paid 45 like $46 for this. And the jacket that I did want cost 35 but I ordered this one. I ordered this one, and I kind of liked it. So I was like, you know, I mean, it, it's a little. It, I didn't want it this, but I still liked it, so I kept it. Um, I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on But like I said, it's really nice and soft. Pull and bear. The quality of their jackets are really. I don't have a pull and bear jacket, um, hoodie, or shirts or pants stuff like that. But for sure, their jackets are really good. They're really good. Uh, I would say this is probably a little, even better than Zora, than the one I bought. Um, black, obviously, is my favorite color. So I'm going to show you guys what it looks like on me. So yeah, this is what the jacket looks like. I really like it. Um, yeah, I thought it was, it's a bit too expensive to be honest, 45, 46, okay. 46 euros. To me, that's a bit expensive for a jacket. I mean, it's, and the one I wanted was 35, which is a good price, but the fuck? Anyways. So yeah you guys that was the video that was all that was me trying on the clothes hopefully you liked it and um, let me know in the comment section if you like this type of videos and if you want to see more things like this check out my patreon so that <laughs> you can help me actually buy them because i'm broke anyways i love you guys i'll see you guys later